What's up everyone, this is Cybernod, and today I finally got my case of dual power in the mail, and yeah, that means we actually have 12 dual power boxes to open up, as you guys can see, it's hard to get them even all on camera. Um, not a bad problem to have, by the way, just saying, because I've been really excited about this set, and uh... Yeah, let's get to it. I, I don't want to talk the whole time. We got to open these. I got to see if I have some good luck or what. So first one we're going to open up normally. And then the others, I'm thinking I'm probably going to uh, just get the packs out. And then uh, we're just going to go through them like that to kind of make the opening a little quicker. But yeah, if you guys enjoy this opening and you want to see more case openings in the future, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Because if this does well, I can definitely open up more cases like I'm thinking about for the main set. Anyway, uh, first off, uh, you get a promo pack in all of these. So, uh, it's the same promo pack, not random. You get each of the main character's cards. So, you have, of course, Dark Magician, Elemental Hero Neos, Stardust Dragon, Uto uh, number 39 Utopia, excuse me. I'm trying to skip the number part. <laughs> Odd Eyes Vigil Dragon, and then Decode Talker. So, yeah, they're all ultra rare. Again, you get one of those each time. So, that's the only time I'm going to go through that one. Then, also under this tray, you actually get a game board. I'm going to have to throw these to the side. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not going to get out the other game boards because it's the same with all of them. But there you go. Actually looks really nice. I do like the design. I, I Like I always say, I'd love it if these were actually, you know, mass man material play mats. But it's pretty cool. I'll, I'll give them that. But yeah, let's get to it. We have so many packs though, but I don't, I don't know the math on it. Was it 12 times 6, I guess? So, <laughs> there we go. All right, so well, first off, we have a Necro's Mirror. Oh, Utopic uh, Automatopoeia. That's pretty cool. That's one of the new ones. Uh, oh, we got a hand strap. It's not Ash Blossom, but I'll take this one. I don't have any of this. Uh, we have Ghost Bell and Haunted Mansion, Fright for Patchwork, and Nine-Tailed Fox. But there we go. I start off with a hand trap. Cyber Knight actually got a hand trap. It's, this is a dream. <laughs> I'm going to wake up here in a second. Yeah, all the hand traps basically have been reprinted in this, including Ash Blossom. Will I get one? Eesh. <laughs> I don't even want to answer that. Lefty Driver. Hot Red Dragon, Archfiend Abyss. Very nice reprint. That went up in price. Uh, Thunder Dragon, uh, Thunderstorm Mech. Gold Gadget. And then El Shadal Fusion. Also, I don't know if I'm going to do a recap on this video because everything's holographic. So, try watching the whole thing. I, you'll be my favorite fan if you do, right? Or favorite viewer, I guess. <laughs> A double hero attack. Cleefort Genius. I'm happy about that one. The Link Monster again. Uh, Vision Hero Vion. And then Goki Cage Match. God, there's so many cool looking cards in this. There's The new cards artwork is amazing. And then, of course, these reprints are great. Oh, we finally got the Boral card. I forgot about this one. Uh, Booster Dragon. Boral Link Monster. Natria Beast. Number 39, Utopia Double. So yeah, technically we have a new number monster, so that means i got to rearrange my number binder. But yeah, new form to Utopia is actually in this. Have Mark of the Rose, and then El Shadal Construct. So happy that I got a reprint. Those are tough to get. Since it's off the ban list, of course, if you didn't hear about it. Let's see, another one of uh, Lefty Driver, make sure it focuses. Then also Archfiend Abyss. A Dark Calvary. So yeah, uh, Dark Magician also got a new fusion. It's Gaia, basically, and Dark Magician. So that is awesome. Also, a uh, Galaxy Soldier, another good reprint, seriously. And Backup Supervisor. In case people are wondering, too, if you're returning to the game or whatever, this is the set I recommend for you. Because you get so many good cards from it, good cards to even trade or whatever. So it's a good way to build up your collection. Uh, Necro's Unicorn. Neck cross of Unicorn. <laughs> then uh, we have a Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit. Another hand trap. XC Change Tactics and Gold Gadget. Wow, that that was pretty interesting. Has anyone else got a double like that? Can it be that way with impermanence? <laughs> all right, so real quick, I'll probably like uh, fast forward everything, and we're just going to get all the packs out, and uh, we're just going to get to it. So here we go. All right, and we are back. So, yeah, I went on ahead, just got all the packs out. Don't worry about the game boards. I'm just going to have to get those out of the boxes later to save some time. But, yeah, here's all of our promo packs. And, like I said, let's just get into these packs. I mean, seriously, I'm hoping we're going to have some good luck out of this. I figure this might be the smarter way of doing the opening, too. Save you guys some time, and, yeah, let's get to it. <laughs> we have Ancient Gear Golem Ultimate Pound. Uh, King Atom. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, Platinum Gadget, we got that one finally. El Shadal Fusion, and then Preta Plant uh, Spider Orchid. Again, I don't know if we're going to do a recap, because 
Yeah. <laughs> there, everything's ultra rare, so. Uh, we have Soul Pendulum. Oh, I love that artwork, too. That one looks cool. Uh, High Priestess of Prophecy. Bond between teacher and student. Finally got that card in English, too. Uh, Riety Driver. And then also Link Disciple. Which I love that's an ultra rare now. That looks really cool. I love the rarity boosts that are also in this set. There's some good choices. Yep, there's one too. <laughs> Cleefort Genius. I'm happy about that one. Then a Tactical Exchanger. A Ghost Reaper and Winter Cherries. Hey, another hand trap. There we go. <laughs> Mark of the Rose. And then Harpy Dancer. Only thing is, I wish that the Harpy uh, Link Monster was in this set. It's not, unfortunately. Because there's some good reprints for them. I mean, Harpy Dancer definitely needed a reprint. Uh, Hot Red Dragon King uh, Calamity. Archfiend King Calamity. Sure. <laughs> then Star Sarah of uh, Sovereignty. Ghost Bell and uh, Haunted Mansion. That gives me two of those now. Oh, man, that's awesome. Uh, Galaxy Soldier and Backup Supervisor. That's the main hand trap I want because it's uh, probably the most expensive of the hand traps that are in this. So I didn't have good luck getting Haunted Mansion at all for my openings in the past. Heretic Dragon King of Tom. Crystal Wing. So, yeah, that's in this. Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. Then we have Beat Cop from the Underworld. So kind of a tour guide... Link Monster, sort of, uh, kind of, I guess. Then Eternal Soul. And then also we have Heretic Dragon of Tefnuit. So that even got a rarity boost. I still have, like, my super rares from back in the day. They also have their Link Monster in the set, too, which is uh, pretty cool. Uh, Divine Serpent Gek. That one's cool looking, too, I gotta say. Uh, Dark Magical Circle. Necros of Trishula. There we go. There's one of the big Necros monsters that we need from this, so that's awesome. Uh, Trickstar Holly Angel, the altar art, so that's cool. And Stardust Wish. But yeah, if I get all the Necrols again, we might have to do a deck profile. I'm planning a few deck profiles. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have any requests on that. Necrols Mirror. That's awesome looking too. Uh, Utopic Automatopoeia. Uh, number 39 again, Utopia Double. I still love that. Like, that's actually a pretty scary card. Uh, the Winged Dragon of Raw Immortal Phoenix. So even a Phoenix Mode. I think Sphere Mode is also in this. And then a Shadal Construct. So the Link Monster actually has a Hollow now. What was it? A Common, I think. So, And it's first printing. So having a Rarity Boost is really cool. Then we have another one, a Lefty Driver. Necrols of Unicorn. Very nice. Uh, Aroma Seraphy uh, Jasmine. Finally got this card too. Another Link card. That we're missing. Link Disciple. And then Odd Eyes Advanced Dragon. So yeah, this is kind of the upgrade of Odd Eyes, obviously. So it's pretty cool. I am tempted to build Odd Eyes again, but I'm kind of waiting for Revolution Dragon, which is a manga promo for Japan, so I have no idea what we're getting it. I was hoping it'd be thrown in this, but unfortunately not. Maybe Battle's a Legend. Let's see. Soul Pendulum, High Priestess of Prophecy, Platinum Gadget, Eternal Soul, and then another one of Tefnuit. I still love that Soul Pendulum artwork, though. <laughs> that is really cool. Uh, another one of Star Seraph Sovereignty. Hot Red Dragon King Calamity. Uh, Magic Gate of Miracles. Chaos Form. And then Necro's uh, Kaleidoscope. I think they said Necro's Cycle, by the way, will be in Battles of Legend as a hollow. So, I remember them saying that on the Konami blog, so in case people were wondering. Oh, here's another Link Monster we don't have yet. Uh, Goki Jet Ogre. So yeah, that's a new Goki Link Monster, obviously. <laughs> then Preda Plant, Orphe Scorpio. Another really cool rarity boost. Thunder Dragon Link Monster. Uh, Colossalus, another one of those. And then a Toon Dark Magician Girl. That one seems kind of random to me, but it, it's a cool reprint. I guess it was kind of tough to get. I honestly don't know. I still have like my Shonen Jump promos for back in the day. We have a Silver Gadget, Necro's Mirror. Bomb Between Teacher and Student. Then another one of Holly Angel. And then uh, Stardust Wish. I'm hoping we get Borload. There's a, he has an alt art in this. So help me out here. Heart of the Cards. Another one, I guess my third one actually, of Utopic Automatopoeia. Lefty Driver. Thunder Dragon. That must be pretty easy to get. I have <laughs> quite a few of those now. Margo the Rose. And then Harpy Dancer. Right, last one for our first pile, I guess. <laughs> Come on, Impermanence. I need to see one of those. Uh, Ancient Gear Golem Ultimate Pound. Atom. Aero Symphony uh, Jasmine. 
then Link Disciple, and then another one of Odd Eye's Advanced Dragon. And we need one more Ghost Spell for a playset. Maybe I'll get that. I have a Lifty Driver, uh, Archfiend Abyss this time. That's really cool. I'm glad they finally reprinted that. Also, uh, we finally got one of these. This one is uh, Crowley the First, uh, uh, how do you say that? Prophesier? Uh, yeah, Prophesier. I could not read that through the camera. <laughs> it looked weird. But yeah, we finally got the Prophecy Link monster. So that's awesome. Another one we've been waiting on for a while. A uh, Double Bite Dragon. And then a uh, Star Seraph Scepter. Yeah, they actually put a, quite a few Link monsters in this set that we were missing. So I'm glad about that. I have Goki Jet Ogre. Another one of those. Orphe Scorpio. Ash Blossom! There we are! <laughs> I can't get it in my Kaiba case. Fine! I'll get it out of dual power. There you go. It's, the, the streak's not technically broken, is it? No. <laughs> this technically, I guess, doesn't count, but I'll take it. I'm still going to use this card out of spite. <laughs> then also, Elshadal Fusion. And then Hot Red Dragon, Archfiend Bane. I don't think we've gotten one of those yet. Looks really cool. It's an ultra rare. But there you go. <laughs> Gosh, if you guys don't know, I opened up a case last year of Legendary Collection Kaiba, and that was like the first big reprint was Ash Blossom in that. Didn't get one. Whole case. So I'm never going to get over that, honestly. <laughs> oh, well, we got one now. Anyway, uh, Link Karibo, Silver Gadget, Platinum Gadget, there you go, <laughs> Chaos Form, and Necro's uh, Kaleidoscope. Link Karibo looks nice. Guess it's, you know, if you didn't get the Shonen Jump one. Right, another one of Atom. Then, uh, of course, Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon, Ghost Bell. There we go. I actually have a playset, so this time I'm having good luck getting hand traps. Who knew? <laughs> it's this is a uh, new new me, right? <laughs> I don't know. I'm glad I actually had good luck getting that one. Before a pal, uh, Smile Sorcerer, and then Ridey Driver. So yeah, I actually got a playset of Ghost Bell. Wow. I figured there's no way, you know. <laughs> I figured it would be it would be the Ash Blossom of this set for me. Unicorn, then yeah. Uh, let's see, oh yeah, Trickstar Magical Laurel, that's one we hadn't said yet. Archfiend Bane, and then another one of Kaleidoscope. Having good luck getting the, the spells for the Necros. Hopefully see more of the monsters. Miracle Fusion, hadn't seen that one yet. Then, oh, well that makes sense, get those together. Elemental Hero Grand Merge. Brand new Elemental Hero card in this set, and... I think it's supposed to be a callback to the originals. It looks amazing. And Brownek. Well, there we go. We we're talking about uh, Necros. We actually got Necros and Brownek. I have two so far now from this. That's cool. Uh, Tefnuit. And then XC Change Tactics. I say two, by the way, because I opened up a box yesterday and I got Brownek. This is the first one I've gotten from this case, though. Hope I get a place out of all of them. So we might have to build that. That might be fun. Anyway, Dark Magical Circle, Cleaver Genius, Infinite and Permanent. Finally, there we go. <laughs> that was That's the other card I was afraid I wouldn't even get one. Uh, I've heard, I think this is the toughest card to get right now in the set. From what I've seen, I really hope we get a play set, but I'm glad I at least got one. So, so far, I'm not the guy that only got, or that missed out on one card <laughs> in this case. So that makes me feel better. But we got one of Impermanent, so that is awesome. I'm going to set that to the side. Mark of the Rose and then Construct. We're going to count our permanences, I feel like. That's one of the main cards I would really like to get placed it of. have uh, Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon. Yeah. Uh, Platinum Gadget. Uh, Visionary Vion. And then Goki uh, Cage Match. Also, by the way, I don't think I said this at the beginning. I'll add it <laughs> in or, or something. But I got this case from Bacon Collectibles. So be sure to check them out. Link in the description. I, I forgot. I didn't even say that. I was too excited. So, yeah. Check them out. Anyway, Star Surf Sovereignty. Lefty Driver. Another one of Winter Cherries. I'll take it. Then Holly Angel and Tefnuit. Come on, Borloo. That's still like one of the main ones I want from this. Because Altar Art. Uh, Soul Pendulum, then a Dark Magic Circle, uh, Magic Gate of Miracles, Stardust Wish, and then Mark of the Rose. Man, I wish Re Revolution Dragon was in this. Another one of Ge. Yeah, <laughs> just saying that part of the name now. Uh, Grand Merge. I still love that. That looks so cool. 
Security Dragon. Yeah, we finally got this card too. Finally in the TCG, uh, we can use this. This one's, I think, been out for the OCG now for a year or two. Something like that. It's been a while. So, yeah, that's another one of the big uh, new cards we're getting from this. So that is awesome. I'm glad I got one of these. I was wondering how tough it would be. Uh, let's see. Uh, Shadal Construct and then Link Disciple. Well, there we go. We got our pretty much baby Firewall Dragon, I guess is what Security Dragon's supposed to be. So that's awesome. Another one of Divine Serpent. Wow. <laughs> We're going to get a few of that one, I feel like. Uh, Dark Magic Circle and uh, Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit. There we go. I think that's, I think that's the second one. So another hand trap. <laughs> then also uh, Goki Cage Match and Construct. Seems like Construct's usually the last one in the pack. Anyone else notice that? Morphe Scorpio, Atom. Then evenly matched, that's pretty good too. I, I think I already have a place set of these, but I'll, I'll take some extras for sure. I got one of these yesterday too. So that, that is still like one of the best reprints. I, I shouldn't downplay it, honestly. It's a really good reprint. Uh, Exceed Change Tactics and Eternal Soul. I might have to rebuild Dark Magicians after this too. <laughs> we'll see. I, I won't promise too much. King Calamity. Tactical Exchange, Necros of Brownack. I actually got three now, so that's awesome. That's another really good card from this. Advanced Dragon and Eternal Soul. What am I missing? Oh yeah, the new Cyber Dragon. We need to get one of those. Naxter, I think is his name. I need one of those. Uh, let's see, Link Kribo, uh, Miracle Fusion, Number 39 Utopia Double, then Kaleidoscope and Teftimit. Oh, okay. We're opening that one weird. Whatever. Unicorn. Focus. There we go. <laughs> Miracle Fusion. Security Dragon there. Then also a Super Quantal Mech King Great Magnus. So yeah, they actually reprinted that, which is good. And then Immortal Phoenix. Yeah, they're getting uh, new support in the next set, the Quantals. So that should make them a lot easier to get. I know that was, I think, pretty much the only expensive card for them, really, that I remember. Then a Sovereignty. King Calamity, evenly matched. Another one of those, I think I have a play set now, at least from this set. Then a Nine-Tailed Fox and Gold Gadget. I love this. <laughs> I gotta say, I love this set. Like, every pack, I have something good. At least, like, one card that's really good. Pretty much all of them are good, though. Uh, Silver Gadget. Then Necro's Mirror. Uh, Magic Gate of Miracles. Fright for Patchwork. And then Construct. It's either the Link Monster or the Fusion that we get at the end, I still say. Another one of Utopia, Onomatopoeia, I think I say that one. Uh, Lefty Driver, Aromage Jasmine, so that was another big reprint. Finally got one, must be kind of tougher to get. Decode Destruction and uh, Star Seraph Scepter. Gonna make another pile, just in case. <laughs> All right, Magical Circle, Genius. Then, uh, yeah, we out, we got this card. I always forget about this one for some reason because I think it's in some other set. It is a Magician of Chaos. So yeah, a new ritual for a Dark Magician, which this one is really good. I'm looking forward to getting the other one too because you can use them together. But that looks awesome. Look at that artwork. Like seriously, that's one of the coolest cards ever. Then starts Wish and Mark of the Rose. I've heard he's pretty tough to get from this set too. A, a few people were saying that. I, have, I want to get it anyway because, yeah, it's Dark Magician, but I'm tempted to build something around it. Let's see. Tactical Exchange. Sovereignty. Draw of Fate. I don't think we've gotten this one yet. That's cool artwork. Then Harpy Dancer and Galaxy Soldier. I think Galaxy Soldier is actually easier to get in, in this than it was in, what, Battles of Legend? So that's kind of funny. Might want to pick them up. Uh, Atom. Then Pendulum, or Soul Pendulum, excuse me. Platinum Gadget, Decode Destruction, and Double Bite Dragon. Man, I don't know how many we've gone through already. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. Uh, High Priestess of Prophecy, Silver Gadget, Trickstar, uh, Foxglove Witch. I guess we... No, we haven't got that one yet. That's cool. Scepter, and then uh, the Met King. I'm just going to say it like that. All right. Another one of Archfiend Abyss, then Unicorn. Card of Demise, that's another really good reprint. It's been reprinted before, but still tough to get. Uh, Tomb Dark Magician Girl and Arrow Mage uh, Rosemary. 
We have the main Arrow Mage cards were reprinted in this. Jasmine and Rosemary. Since they finally got their Link Monster. Miracle Fusion. Yeah. <laughs> then uh, the Prophecy Link again. El Shadow Fusion and Prada Plant Spider Orchid. I feel like we have to be more than halfway through. Come on in permanence. I want to get a few more. Uh, Grand Merge. King Calamity, Brownack. Well, I'm having good luck getting that one at least, so that's good, I guess. I thought that would be the toughest. Uh, Mark of the Rose and Harpy Dancer. Yeah, I figured Brownack would be by far the toughest to get. Let's see. Another one of Winter Cherries. I'm just going to name off ones that uh, are, I don't know, notable now. Because I, I think we've named off, like, a lot of these several times, and I don't want to be annoying on that. Another hero, though. <laughs> and another Ash Blossom. There you go. Again, way better luck in 2019, I guess, than 2018. <laughs> Link Disciple. I might actually get three. That, that might be possible. Uh, we have Great Ogre, Goki Great Ogre. That's the Alter Art. Card Demise. There you go. I think I have a place that now Card of Demise. That's good. Booster Dragon. Yeah, a couple of the Aurel Mage cards. Alright, Gadgets. And yeah, even Advanced Dragon, another one of those. Kind of wish he was level 7. I feel like it might be a little bit better, though. I don't know. Again, I feel like none of it matters till we get Revolution. Necroz, Link Monster. Oh, this is... We haven't got one of these yet. Galaxy has Full Armor Photon Dragon. That's a good reprint, too. And then also Signal Warrior. I haven't got this one yet, either. It's Yusei's uh, uh, bike, I guess, motorcycle, and it's a Transformer. So, <laughs> that's cool. I had not seen one of those just yet. I think I heard that one was kind of difficult to get to for some reason. Like, I, I wouldn't think that one would be that tough to get. But it is. Evenly matched. There you go. Another one of Perform Pal Smile Sorcerer. I don't know if I said his name before, so I'll just say it again. All right. Another Utopia. Uh, there's uh, Wing Dragon Roll Sphere Mode. So, yeah, I finally got one of those. It must be kind of tough to get. Jasmine. It's like the first one I've seen. Another card that needed a reprint. Like, basically, they had good choices with this, I, I will say. Konami did a good job. Unicorn, Prophecy. Although I'm a little nervous about Impermanence. <laughs> oh, here we go. This card was finally printed, too. We know we're getting the, the card that brings it out in the next special edition. Anyway, Quintet Magician. So yeah, it's basically a five god dragon, five headed dragon for spellcasters is the best way to put it. So that's awesome. They actually printed that. Also printed a plant, uh, Drago uh, Stapella, another one that got a rarity boost. Winter cherries. That's awesome. I hadn't seen Quintet Magician yet. I love his artwork too. He's just like a supercharged dark magician kind of. Let's see. Uh, Toon Dark Magician Girl. And I think I have time for one more, and then we're going to restart the face cam. Because you guys know, it doesn't like to record too long. It gets overheated. Anyway, <laughs> Unicorn. Oh, there we go. We actually got one of Valkyris. I hadn't seen this one yet. So, Necros Valkyris. That's awesome. Okay, we're going with one more. You, you can't just do that. <laughs> so, let's see. I, I might be pushing it. Divine Serpents. Uh, grand merge and impermanence. See, it was worth it. It's worth risking it for that one more. And yeah, two of impermanence. And there we go. So I'm going to restart the face camp. We'll be right back. All right, and we are back. So we got a second impermanence. That's awesome. If I can just get one more, <laughs> I'm hoping for that play set. Bond between teacher and student. I love that card. It looks so cool. I think there's a 20th anniversary version of it. Might need to get it. Oh. Don't pull the cards out of your hand. Another one of Tactical. That one must be pretty easy to get. And then another one of a Ghost Spell. Well, there we go. I think I actually got four of these now. So, again, Hand Trap Luck is a little bit better in this opening. I'm glad. Stars Wish and Chaos Form, even. 
to really start stacking them up on the other pile, but I can't help myself. <laughs> Just breaking our own rules today. And there's another one of Magician of Chaos. So we might actually get three, I hope so. He looks, you can't tell me that doesn't look awesome, seriously. Signal Warrior, another one of those two. I'll be honest, I want a place set of everything from this set. Even reprints I already have a bunch of, just because. <laughs> I can't help it. I'm just hyped about this one. Let's see. Oh, there's another one, Dark Calvary. I'll take that. That's still a cool card. Signal Warrior. I got a play set then. I love Dark Calvary just because of what it is. It's Gaia and Dark Magician fused together. That sounds like some kind of fan fiction thing, you know? <laughs> that is so cool. Ancient gear, let's see, a Tom. Another one of Ash Blossom, I think I got my play set. If I counted right, I think we actually got a play set of Ash Blossom. Who needs Kyle the Legendary Collection, you know? I swear it's not in that set. I don't care what any of you say. I'm, I'm still holding to that theory. I've opened up like probably two cases of Legendary Collection Kyle, but never got an Ash Blossom, so. Yeah, if you tell me it's in there, you're lying. I don't, I don't care what you say, you're lying. <laughs> uh, Soul Pendulum. Let's see, Utopia Double. Hope people know that I'm only half joking about that too, by the way. All right, uh, let's see. Crystal Wing. Prophecy. Man, Borload must be tough to get. I haven't seen that one yet. One of my friends said he only got one from his case, so maybe it is really tough to get. Natural Beast. Another one secured during. I think I got a blaze set of those now. All right, only a few packs left, so can we get that last in permanence? Or bore load? I mean, I'd like both of those, but I feel like I have to make a choice. <laughs> we'll see. Scorpio, a Tom, card demise, there you go. Feels like each pack at least has one really good reprint that you, that you want. Or it's working out that way for me. Cleave Fort. Then, oh yeah, what's this? Uh, Draw of Fate. Then Colossus. Man, I was hoping that was Joshua. That's the one, I think it's the only one we haven't gotten yet. All right. Ancient Gear Golem. And then another one, Dark Calfrey. Guess that gives me a place up. Another one of Bane as well. And come on. Last couple of packs. Boar Load and Permanence. We'll see. Have Pendulum Soul. Prophecy. Uh, well, my hand trap. Okay. <laughs> we'll have to take that Ghost Ogre. And then even uh, Zayborg. Oh, yeah, I forgot he was in this. Uh, Zayborg the me Mega Monarch. Blah, I can't say it. <laughs> so, yeah, that was another really good reprint, by the way. That's awesome. Luckily enough, I got my play set of those before they went up in price. So, I, I still have a play set. And, yeah, last pack. What are we going to end with? Can we end with more load or impermanence? We'll go with that instead of a hollow. Let's see. Because we know we should get a hollow. <laughs> The one time I say that, it might not happen. King Calamity. Then we have Jet Ogre, Trickstar, Foxglove Witch, Kaleidoscope, and then Colossalus. So, yeah, unfortunately, uh, none of uh, Bore Load. I'm kind of surprised about that. I, I guess that is tougher to get. Again, maybe other people are having luck. It might just depend on that. But I was able to get two of Impermanence. So, I'm pretty happy about that. I think it was four of Ghost Spell. And I feel like in most of the main cards I wanted, I got a play set. So, honestly, I'm happy with my case. I think I had some really good luck. Just, uh, unfortunately, no board load, like I said. And I didn't get that third in permanence. But we all know this isn't going to be the only <laughs> of these uh, dual power boxes I'm going to open up. So... Yeah, you, you know I have a problem. But <laughs> I hope you guys have enjoyed this opening either way. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know down in the comments how you guys have done with this set. If you got like whatever cards that you were looking for or what cards you're most excited about from this. And yeah, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, ring that bell so you don't miss out. Again, this does well. We can definitely do more case opens in the future. And let me know. As always, thank you guys for watching. Hope you have a great day. And of course I will catch you guys later. See ya.